In the first part, we were obligated to retread old ground story-wise. We had to re-establish the origin story. But you know, now we are free to play the characters in the way we want, we want to play them and throw everything in the mixing pot and, and see what comes out. Max is this guy who designs the power grid for Oscorp, doesn't get credit for it, so his job fails him. So he's feeling kind of tight, and all of a sudden he runs into Spider-Man, and Spider-Man says his name. You're Spider-Man. Yeah, I know. Costume gives it away, huh, Max? How do you know my name? Your badge. And so he obsesses over Spider-Man, and then when finally he does turn into Electro, he's seeking Spider-Man out. Hey, I have these powers too. Maybe we could fight crime together. And it doesn't work out that way. Not everybody gets a chance to play a villain. But it's something that you can look back on for years. It is bigger, and it's a uh, more confident film. Need a hand? And just honoring and trying to serve something greater, trying to serve the character. You wanted to be the hero. Now you gotta pay the price. Let's go catch a spider.